Good morning everyone and welcome to Monday. How are we all doing today? Yeah, boys went back to school today. They couldn't wait to get back to school, especially Sammy. Couldn't wait to tell his friends all about Yarmus. I'm um, going on that big wheel and obviously bowling in the arcades and stuff. Yeah, we had a really, really lovely time. But it's just weird because since we come back on Friday, Saturday and yesterday, the boys had such attitudes on them like crazy. And there's their missing the coast, not I really, really do not know. But yeah, it was just a crazy amount of times we told them off yesterday. We even threatened to turn the Wi-Fi off for Sammy because his attitude and things like that. I know some of it could be a hormone thing for the teenager, but yeah. So hopefully, fingers crossed, back to school today, he comes home in a much better mood with. But, and also, yeah, so, um, like I said, sent off some pictures to their teachers so they can share them with their friends. I know it was quite hard to pick some photos because also we've got some really, really lovely photos. I don't know if you've actually seen this one on the vlog. This one here, I do like this one here. That you can see there's Ben, is absolutely loving looking at the ocean tunnel there well I say it's a tunnel actually it's a nice big tank yeah shouldn't you see like something that we've been to they've got like the big massive tank before the ocean tunnel I mean what I thought was so cute though obviously we took them round to the ocean tunnel and then he said you want the ocean tunnel you, you walk back round to the tank himself bless him so yeah he really really loved it he really really did but nice if we could do it a bit more often with them as well take them out to all these sea life centres and stuff but obviously it's just a question of um doing that weekends but unfortunately it's even work saturday so can i do it on the sunday but i'm sure we've got lots of fun days planned out for the summer holidays and stuff as well so but yeah so while the kids are at school i've got a catch up with my holiday washing I've got a nice big pile of washing here to, to do that's the problem when you go away is that all the holiday washing to come back with um also got to go to the hospital at some point get ben's medication you've got to go to two different pharmacists actually because when we when we ordered it for you went away they didn't have all the medication in um one of them was, was a necessity so we need to go back up to hospital they didn't have it in but they'd half of it in so yeah <laughs> before we went away it was quite i wouldn't say it's stressful it's just chasing around after those medication so it's all back in now apparently so i need to go and sort all that, that out as well as doing the dishwasher so yes yeah, so it's gonna be one of those mondays i think where i just got to update with all the housework and bits and pieces i think yeah so it's been a busy and productive morning to be honest if you manage to get all the washing sorted out all into piles it gets all the holiday washing it's like you sort all out all the colors and all the jumpers and stuff i don't really tend to sort all the colors out from the dark so i just put i just bang them all in hope for the best to be honest with you anything i do separate is like all the underwear and all the towels that sort of thing so yeah and also it's amazing once sort all out about the sand We've actually brought back with us. It's sort of like we brought the armor to speech back. The amount of sand is just crazy. Um, there's no sign though. Sand seems to go everywhere. It really does. Probably doesn't help the way that Ben just picks it up and throws it or covers himself in the sand. But again, he has such a really, really amazing time. We really, really did. And then we went about to see if we, there's any way we could have a, like a sand pit put in the garden for him where he can sit in. I know he'll really, really love that. We did, was it last year, year before? We did actually buy him like a little one way to fit in, but obviously it was far too small for Ben, and so I wasn't interested in it, so we sold it on. But yeah, we thought if we can get one like custom made for him for his size, he something he would enjoy during the summer. So that's definitely something to think about for him. See so if he thinks he could get some planks of wood, like a pallet, he could do it himself, so he's gonna try and do it. And then just get a whole load of sand, and then obviously just, try and make a little something like that just in case it rains but then also trying to get dishwasher to work as well for some reason it was having one of its moments where it just didn't want to work really do not know what was wrong with it it's like the button you program didn't want to work so just turn it off at the wall turn it back on again it seemed to work so it's probably having one of its moments so to speak yeah just hope it doesn't go wrong but we have got covers on everything in the house just in case everything does break down but anyway, yes, yeah, so now I'm just heading off to the hospital to get Ben's medication because obviously before we went away, we put it all in and should have picked it up on the Friday before we went away, but not everything was ready. One pharmacist couldn't get nothing in, the other couldn't get half in, so yeah, I'm having to go to two different uh, pharmacists today to get all of Ben's medication because we couldn't get half and obviously when we was away, 
use that supply up so he, basically he needs it now so and then this afternoon Stephen said he wants to sort out Ben's room because we're going to have deep clean I think Ben's room is the only room in the house that hasn't had a deep clean because we've done our room we've done Ben Sammy's room and we've done the living room as well so yes so the only room did get to, was hoping to get it done before he went away but time just got away with us so we're going to do that as well because you can see the weather outside isn't the greatest and nothing like that I have got some plants to go in the garden but I'll wait for it to be go a little bit dry I think first anyway yes I just went to the hospital hope fingers crossed they got yes, Ben's bed in we're just in Ben's room now and all I said earlier on give this room a bit of a deep clean um seems as given Ben said so about trucks a bit of a wipe I can't believe my trucks is actually gone can you it's got loads of them they do actually cost quite a bit of money to be honest with you and now I think they'll probably be worth something because they're not like that brand anymore, are they? No. Who brought them out? The Kalina? Was it Kalina? Kalina brought out quite a few chains. It did do, didn't that? Yeah. Because um, obviously, we, even though when we've been out on the road and stuff, they don't look the same anymore. No, of course they don't. Because they've even got, for the, was that, the people on their head of Barts, they were well known for having the names on the trucks. So you can see that one on there. That's called um, Emma. Emma Jade, I think it was on that one. Of course, and they've stopped all that, haven't they? And mm. um, I'll tell you what are valuable. It's got some of these, these little ones. These ones are still in their boxes. Like, I think my friend actually gave them to Ben, these, didn't she? Because you know Ben loved Eddie Stober. What do the Teletubby? What do you mean the Teletubby? It was like a TV production truck. I remember that one. Oh, yeah. He's got one of the um, Pirelli Formula One ones around here somewhere, hasn't he? He's got the horse box, yeah. Mm. I think it's got one of every truck, I think, to be honest with you. Really has. Oh, yeah, the telly me that one. That's a curtain. That was a curtain cider one. There you go. He's even got one of the little, look, Eddie, steady Eddie trucks. Happy journeys for safe kids. Um, one of the stay bark rail ones, which is that one. Oh, it would be. But you can see where he went with the stage of playing them, didn't you? I just wish left in the boxes now for him. I'm looking for the um thing we has one's got the double one. Here you go. These ones here, it's got one of the double ones. What are they called? Uh road trains. A oh, road train, yeah, it's got two it's got one of them as well, hasn't he? Mm. So yeah, it's got loads and it's even got like a little little car. A little truck here as well. And He's got some little coasters as well. So yeah, he's got quite a few of them actually. He's even got some of the signed ones when we met. Who did we meet? Mark, Ashley, Tim, Mick, and who was the other one we met? I can't remember his name now, can you? Really can't. But anyway, so like I said, we can give these a bit of a clean. Um, you're taking you're taking these books off to clean or not? I'm taking everything out. I'm cleaning this whole section down. It needs a good old cleaner, doesn't it? Yeah. No, I'd like to decorate his room again for him, you know. Yeah, you need, the, I, state of the, ceiling. the ceiling he's doing as well, but we need to check the floor. I think because obviously here when we had the leaky raise it, you know, we had the leaky bath, didn't we? And yeah. the bathroom has caused a bit of a gap down here, so we need to get this floor checked. So we need to check the house and insurance, see if we can pay for it on that. to be the one you can trust I feel so useless cause I let you down I hope there's some way I can make it alright cause I know that you deserve much more than this if you give me one more chance I swear I'll try my best to always be there and I and found out his little baby box or little mementos and stuff but yeah look his first little pair of trainers aren't they so cute and small considering now it's a size 14 shoe yeah it's like how on earth did that actually fit in when he was little i also got in here his first ever dummy 
it's, well, it's a bit flat now but it's obviously it's nice to keep though isn't it as well um what else have got in here it's first ever vest it's got my little car on that one again so tight you hard to believe they'll fit into them would you what's this one here oh yeah it's first ever baby gray look winnie the pooh what size was that that was a newborn wow you get you think to yourself how on earth was he that tiny really was scary to think obviously he's got his shawl as well oh yeah it's his first little leather coat he come home from hospital in he's got a little he's a happy little elephant on that one obviously oh yeah bhs um obviously they don't exist anymore do they also got in here little teddy what's that little oh yeah part, that's part of the set oh yeah that's part of the set that one was so yeah um it's the first little car oh yeah it's first ever christmas out of it because obviously he was a christmas baby little, little christmas quacker yeah so it look, oh it's always nice to look these back up so often What's that on there? Obviously, there's other dummy there as well. It's got, oh yeah, his first, yeah, the baby's first Christmas. That was in his cot or Moses basket with him. So, yeah, it's always nice to look back at these things. What else I've got in here? Oh yeah, all my cards and stuff here. Obviously, when he was christened and stuff. Oh, some baby photos. I'd even cut out the um, his baby book. So, yeah, quick show you this one things in here. Obviously, yeah, me and Stephen, when we first got locked together, how young do we look on that photo? <laughs> and look, there's my baby scan. When was that done? Yeah, it was done. Yeah, 2005. That was just a few weeks before he was born. And, yeah, so these are quite good. Yeah, it's nice to have day. That was when he was soon after he arrived home. They go, just go to pre for the big feet. That was his feet at 10 weeks. So, yeah. Obviously, obviously, Sammy's got one of these as well. With Sammy's things in them. Yeah, that cheeky smile. Thing is, this is what scary was. On these photos here, there was no signs of autism in, in Ben at all. Go to sleep. That was, and, um, which one was it on? Yeah, look, there's no, no signs of autism whatsoever. Really wasn't. Look, you still like to see if on this side now. So, yes, yeah, so the boys are home from school. Moss had got on the money. You got a parcel, Sammy? I don't know what's inside there. Take it from the side. Take it on the side? Yeah. This side. Look how brown yeah, Sammy good. looks still. Yeah. Take it from there. Something you asked for. My t shirt. Let's have a look. Have a look properly. What's it say on there? I'm in the game, uh, Is that good? Yeah. Hopefully it should fit you. What size did you order him? Mm. It's a jumper, uh, Sammy. It's a jumper. Let's have a look. I don't know. I want to wear it tomorrow, even you though I can see it. You want to wear it tomorrow, do you? Yeah. Okay, we'll see. It's nice. Hey, see Sammy, Sammy the gamer. Oh, that's pretty cool, isn't it? Mm. That is really, really cool, because that is... Name of your YouTube channel, is it, Sammy the Gamer? Is this oh yeah, it's printed on. It's one of those ones you have to wash and line inside out, though, isn't it? It says on there, it always seems. What's that say? Seems impossible until it's done. Yeah, of course it does. Yeah. And that's come from Canva. Come from Canva, hasn't it? What have got there? Mm, got some stickers. Mm. Okay, they're good. Mm. Sammy, should you try it on? See if it fits you. So Sam wanted to try his top on. Do you like it? Yeah. Well, it fits you nice, isn't it? So I'll wear it now until bed, until I get ready for bed. Yeah, you can wait till you get ready for bed, yes. But don't get it dirty then, will you? Alright. No. <laughs> so what, that suits them actually, no. They didn't put anything on the back, innit? Mm. But anyway, sweetheart, how was school? Very good. Was it good to be back to school? Yeah. Yeah? And did you share your photos with your friends? Yeah. What did they say? They love them. They love them, do they? What did they like? The one with... Well, did you turn about the wheel as well? Yeah. Yeah? That's good. So what are the lessons you've been doing at school today? I've done back to, I did drama and I had chill out day today. Drama and chill out day. I don't think you have all these chill out days. I think you're just saying that, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. So what day you got? You still got swimming tomorrow? Yeah. Yeah, so make sure you've got your swimming kit ready and stuff. So, And then PE still on Thursday this week? Yeah. Pushing on Wednesday? Yeah. Yeah? 
So, do you like that then? I like the colours on it though, didn't you? I designed that. Oh, did you design that? Yeah. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool, that is. So, then you lose a good day back, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah, it's one good thing. What about you, Ben? You want another drink? Oh, bless him. Just come up and give um, Stephen his beaker. Yeah, you had a good day, haven't you? Yeah, in fact, they said Ben was good. Glad to be back to school. Even you all brown still, aren't you? It's like you, it's like all you three bathed in mud when we was away. I know what you're going after. Yeah, I know what you're going after. Yeah. Yeah. Go on then. Tip it the other way round. Tip it that way. Now pour them in your bowl. Oh, clever. <laughs> Oh well, you have to learn from somewhere, don't we? So, yeah, so Ben's just got his snack. Now, you've got no more left now, Ben. All right, have any more after that because they've all gone. But anyway, yes, apparently Ben's had a lovely day back at school, hasn't he, today? They went to Tesco's this morning and they said he absolutely loved it. Well, he loves shopping anyway now, doesn't he? He used to hate it before, but now he loves it. Then you see Tart, only thing is, you've got to realise you can't, you've got to pay for the things, that's the thing he doesn't get. And then obviously he loves sharing his photos or sending in with his friends. And they've been doing some sort of experiments this afternoon, don't you? Which you really enjoy doing. Yeah. Buy you some tea soon as well. Yeah. What are you looking at? You can't have that. He's looking at your biscuit. You can't have that biscuit because that biscuit's got the nasty stuff in you mm. can't have, hasn't it? Yeah, it's got the whole ball beating. Mm. Yeah, they nice. Well, guys, I'll tell you one thing I get in a bit annoyed with is these let me find a Cheryl's you know as I'm filming you right now everything's backwards you know I'm having to go into uh, an editor to swirl this thing around to make sure it's the right way because what I'm reading now that is totally the other way around it's absolutely crazy these Samsung phones I don't know why they don't film in the proper direction what, it right? used to it did. until it had several upgrades and it just went funny yeah. anyway yeah so yeah, there was no vlog yesterday, guys. Yeah, um, I did put out two vlogs the day before, and it was one of the room tour where we stopped in at Haven. And oh my god, guys, that place was massive! I tell it was you, really huge. I felt like getting in a moving truck and moving our stuff there. Uh -huh. It was absolutely amazing place I know. to stop. Yeah, because obviously when Sam went to school this morning, obviously his teacher emails. He kept telling everyone, but where he stayed had his own on suite. He, he was so buzzing, yes, wasn't he today and stuff like that. So yes, yeah, so like Stephen said, took the day off because obviously we had a busy week at um, Yarmouth. Obviously Saturday it was a local carnival, so we just took a nice, lazy, chilled out day yesterday, didn't we? Yeah, we spent yesterday afternoon watching the Queen's Jubilee pageant, which that was, was really, really good. really good. Nice to see the Queen bless her, and uh, when she appeared on the balcony at the end. And um, 96, can you believe she's been there Hello. for 70 years? Eh? Sammy keeps saying he wants to go around Buckingham Palace, doesn't he? Yeah, even I would like to go around there. I've Didn't never been around there before. Comment down below if the Queen's in Buckingham Palace, could you go inside? I'm not too quite sure if you can or you can't. I know you can do tours, can't you? You can do tours, yeah. I don't know because I've never been to Buckingham Palace, so I wonder <laughs> what it's like. Because obviously, also, we um, go to Legoland and things like that. We can actually see Windsor Castle, can't we? And so I'm keep saying what's good to Windsor Castle as well. So yeah. ideas for the summer holidays and stuff, isn't it? It's now the 6th of June, guys, and in a few days' time, someone's birthday. Not quite. Yeah, in about a week on Sunday. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. Father's Day. The worst thing about being a dad is that I have to put up with her birthday on Father's Day, so I can't get the benefit of the day to myself, can I? Excuse me, we <laughs> are going out, so what you like as well, so there. Yeah, well, I'll get you on Ninjago again, see if you can win. Yeah, well, last time, <laughs> didn't I? Did, like I said, we went there for Mother's Day, and we're going to go there for Father's Day as well, so. Yeah, anyway, guys, yeah. Thanks for joining us today. As always, like the video, comment down below, hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you on the next one. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.